What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Oh, what could it be that's hiding in here for me? What's in the box? What's in the box? Is this a model kit or what's in here for me? What's in the box? What's in the box? How hard is it to put together? Is it made of leather? Hey, what's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Today's episode of What's in the Box was filmed right here at Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Slescu and I'm the owner of Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Welcome to another edition of What's in the Box? What's in the Box? So today's box, we have the Volkite Berserkers from the Games Workshop. Now these are the latest dwarves, they are the Fire Slayer dwarves, and they are perfect for the Age of Sigmar. But before I op open up that, I've got a lot of older White Dwarf magazines, and these issues are the ones with the Fire Slayer models in them. And in fact, I think these are, this is the issue that has the Volkite Berserkers. So, uh, this is uh, White Dwarf issue 102 from January, the 9th of January 2016. I still have a few of these on the shelf over there. In fact, I don't know if that, that's my magazine rack, I believe. <laughs> Hard to see it in reverse and everything, but. And this is on there. <clears throat> it's got the war scrolls if you need them for the army. Got a write up on the fire slayers. It shows the, the uh, Volkite Berserkers here. And that's on page six, five, six. Lots of neat stuff here. The hearth guards and all that. It shows you the, uh, talks about the Urgold, how they, they're all infused with little bits of gold and they go looking for gold. But one thing that's very good in these old white dwarves, okay, there's the war scrolls. Um, is that, oh, here's stuff on the Fire Slayer Lodge. Gives you a fold out, very big fold out. But what's nice about these white dwarfs, aha, uh -huh, there it is, is the paint splatter section. So after you've got your model and you've built it, of course you want to paint it. So here they show you how to make the uh, Urgold, how to do the flesh colors, how they did their hair and all the other thing. So these older articles, the old magazines, they're worth it because, of course, they have that information in there. So now, without further ado, let's go to our bench and see what's in the box. Let's take a look at these Volkite Berserkers. Dun 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 So, there's more info on the back of the box, showing you what the models look like. And now we will look at what's in the box. Like how they have runes inside here. There's a G and a, a V. <laughs> One there too on the tab. Okay. Wow, look at that. So, of course, you get the round bases because that's what Sigmar is going for these days. Okay, let's have a look at this part tree here. Wow, look at that. What's on here? Well, bring this close to the camera. We have one of the fire slayers. And look at, there's the axes. And there's another body there. And look at those the faces with the beards. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> and of course there's the shields. And the different men. Look at the, the pickaxe type things they got here. And in this other sprue we have their heads. That's the hair pieces. Actually the hair pieces are separate. And then there's more faces here. That's pretty interesting. The hair pieces are separate, so 
there's a slot there. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry. Slot there to put the hairpiece in. But if you were to fill that in, you could probably use these heads on regular dwarves. So that's pretty cool. And then they give you a little sprue. And again, we got the uh, hair pieces. There's a couple little keys here for the dwarves. And what are these things? Oh, that's their, uh, <laughs> to co cover their little dwarfy bits, the curtain there. <laughs> dwarfy bits. Okay, and again, another sprue. This is similar to the uh, one with the shield, in fact. Oh, they give you little separate hands here. Right there, too. Okay, so... There's our instructions, so... You can build these as Volkite Berserkers with the Fire Steel Hand Axes. And they've got two axes each. Or, with the Fire Steel... Fire Steel War Pick and Bladed Sling Shield. So you got your choice of two-handed weapons or a weapon and a shield, so they have some defense. And of course the instructions are always great. Oh, so that guy is the, is the Carl. <laughs> Gotta watch where I'm moving this to the camera. And this guy is the Horn. And the musician. Yeah. Yeah, so there's the, the little single hands go into those shields and then plug on the bodies. And there's the horn blower guy. And of course you get a war scroll with the Volkite Berserkers right in the instructions, which is always nice because then really you could buy this box, open it up and play it without uh, having to have all the war scrolls. So another great one from Games Workshop. All right. So I hope you enjoyed that issue of What's in the Box. And remember that you can find these at Games Workshop or, better yet, at Monster Hobbies. And uh, be sure to check them out, grab a box, and enjoy building these crazy dwarf warriors. So you can like us at Facebook, Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada, or visit our new website, www.monster-hobbies.ca for Canada and you can check out our videos on YouTube under the Madcap Romanian and what else? Visit the store unit one <laughs> unit 42B 11th Avenue in downtown not in downtown boy oh boy it's first thing in the morning. Must be tired. Our store address is Unit 42B, 11th Avenue, Southeast, in High River, Alberta, Canada. 403-652-5019. And I'm growing this mustache for Movember! Wah! We'll see you later. Bye.